And the important issue is that coaches can't see everything that happens on the pitch. So they need this information to either back up what they think happened or to give them information on what actually happened. Uh, we also, uh, at Liverpool World Club, think it's important that we use data to back up what we're actually saying to the players, um, to give strength to what we're saying in terms of uh, correcting performance. Another, um, I think, important, important point is um, you need this information to, to impact on training, okay, to decide what you're going to do. Uh, is it uh, using the data you've got on, on match performance um, to either correct performance or you can even use instances of good performance from match analysis data or video to actually try and reproduce that again in training. And from a, say from a player point of view, it's, um, a lot of players do like to know, uh, in our club, they do like to know what they've done statistically on the pitch. Um, they like to be able to compare their performance against the teammates sometimes. They like to compare the performance against the average for opposition players, the average for the league. Okay, they always go home with a CD of their, uh, usually video, uh, an edited video of their performance. They do, and the other, I'd say that the, the final area is um, where all this objective information is important is um, uh, opposition analysis um, to really know how the opposition plays. All right, football, it's. Um, it is a random game, uh, things might not go to plan. You might prepare for the opposition at the last minute, the opposition challenge its style of play, change its playing formation, but having this information on the way the opponent plays um, is very, very important.